say hi to the vlog, Nene. Say hi. Um, no. Oh, okay, sorry. I stopped moving. Big mistake. Hi everyone, welcome back to another vlog on my channel. Um, right now I am taking Nate on a little walk, getting my butt back into fitness mode and whew, going for a walk even though it's I think like close to 90 degrees outside right now but I have Nate in this um, super cool onesie so I don't think he'll get too hot and we have a sunshade so yeah I'm just going for a walk I have my water and I'm also filming a what I eat in a day I have a lot to update you guys about so I'm going to go for my walk and then I will be back to talk with y'all. Okay. I just got back from my walk slash, kind of more like a jog. I'm exhausted. Um, I was only out there for 22 minutes, but like I said, it's pretty hot out. And also, I'm just putting my shoes away right now. And also, um, we have a really tall hill in my apartment complex where um, I think even when I was like super in shape like a year or two years ago before our wedding um, even then I could only go up it like two or three times and I just went up it once and then I walked the lower part twice and then the upper part once and I kind of fast walked and I was also pushing the stroller up and down that giant hill so that definitely created some resistance for me I literally have sweat on my forehead <laughs> um, and my neck. All right, so I think that Nate is gonna go down really easy now because he looks so sleepy. Um, so once I get him down, I'll go ahead and have my little powwow with you guys, my little, and it's not little, it's gonna be a pretty long chat. So if you plan on watching the whole thing, maybe get a snack, get some water coffee if it's the morning or you know what I'm not judging if it's 3 p.m. get a coffee whatever that's what I do so I'm gonna try and get him down for a nap which should be pretty easy and then I'm going to have my little life update with you guys okay I just ate my granola bar and now I got a little diaper to change and Sometimes he hates it when I change his diapers. Sometimes he doesn't mind. So let's spin the dice and see what we get. I think we're gonna get hate it. Or are we gonna get like it? Could we get a like it? I'll just try. Hey Nate, say, I didn't mind my diaper change at all. It wasn't that bad. Yeah, that wasn't that bad. He really likes looking at his little map that I got him. It's a scratch off world map. And the point of it is kind of you just scratch off the places you've been. And I kind of want my ideas just for him to keep it his whole life. and always scratch off a place that he's been he'll know where he's been even when he was like a month old <laughs> and he's about to go here in uh no here illinois to see his uncle mike graduate from the navy yay yay and let me know if you guys might be interested in like a uh, nursery tour, I have his whole nursery done. And it's pretty cute. So yeah, here's a little sneak peek. Um, yeah, let me know if you would like to see a nursery tour. Now that we aren't moving, which leads me into what I have to talk to you guys about, um, we aren't moving anymore, so. Now that we aren't moving, I could probably get a nursery tour done for you guys and then you will know what his little nursery looks like in case you need inspiration or something. Or if you're just nosy like me. 
Wow. What else? He says he really likes his nursery. It's pretty cool. Even though this is the only place he hangs out. This is his play gym. And his glider, I guess. Still not using the crib at all. He's he's sat in it a couple times though while I'm editing. So because our computer is actually in his nursery for the time being until we have a different spot for it because right now we literally don't. Our apartment's packed to the brim. Yes. He says it, do it doesn't matter that the computer's in my nursery because I don't even sleep in it. Okay, so recently um, there's been a lot going on in our lives and um oh, oh it kind of for like a while there felt like way too many things happening at once as you guys already know or if you don't if you're new to my channel um we had an issue because uh the maintenance came in for an inspection one day and they uh oh nope all better okay the maintenance came in He's just crying because he's um, tired, by the way. So I'm patting his butt. I'm not neglecting him, don't worry. So the maintenance came in one day um, for a random inspection. They said that we can't have a bunny because we're un they're under new management. And then, um, so we went and talked to them, asked, like, are you sure? Like, we had gotten it approved before. And they were like, oh, yeah, um we absolutely can't allow you sorry and so we decided okay I guess we're moving because the last thing we wanted to do was get rid of my pet well she was my pet first and then Alex and I moved in together and then she became our pet um so she went to stay with my parents for I think she was really um I think only two weeks. So she went to stay with my parents while um, while we were apartment hunting. That way they wouldn't kick us out of the current apartment um, because basically it was an eviction threat um, if we didn't get rid of her. But they didn't like we. So she just went to stay with my parents. We didn't get rid of her. Um, so. You know, we found an apartment. I updated you guys about that. Um, and then last Sunday night, um, my mom called to let me know that Honey, my bunny, had passed away. And, um, oh man. Yeah, so... Honey had passed away and um, now we, well, we aren't going to move anymore because she was the reason we were moving um, and it was going to be a very big expense to move. Um, so obviously I was really heartbroken, I still am, but I'm attempting to move past it. Um, I'm just, I'm not the kind of person who likes to sit around and be sad. I took a couple days to be very sad. I was very sad, I'm not gonna lie. Um, so, yeah, that's that. We aren't going to move now, so we had already packed a lot. Now we have a lot of unpacking to do. Um, like, there's still some stuff in boxes because I just don't have a lot of time without him without Nate being attached to me um, because he's just he's just a little babe he needs his mama a lot a lot a lot I'm right now just trying to focus on our trip to Chicago at the end of September to watch my brother Michael graduate from um, basic and he's um, in the Navy oh. for those oh <laughs> For those of you who might not know. Um, so, 
yeah, we're just kind of focusing on our trip now, trying to get the bad stuff. Oh my goodness. <sighs> For those of you who don't know, we call him Squirmy Wormy because he sure does move a lot. <laughs> so we're just trying to focus on our trip right now and <sighs> kind of get the bad stuff off of our minds. Um, we just went through so much unnecessary stress in that first month and then like the first month of Nate's life um like it's hard enough to have a newborn and then just everything that was added on top of having a newborn for us was like ridiculous and then on top of that then my beloved pet of like six almost seven years I think passed away that yeah so you know we're hurting and we're getting past it slowly but surely this little guy learned how to smile and it sure is making my heart feel a little bit better I know I haven't been on YouTube very much I've still been on Instagram if any of you aren't following me on Instagram I think um, I, I update Instagram much more often than YouTube just because it's a lot easier um, I have plenty of time to film filming isn't the thing that's hard it's finding the time to sit down and edit because I am a stay-at-home mom and it's pretty difficult to find the time where my little newborn baby doesn't want to be held and editing with one hand is doable but it's very hard I have a lot of plans um, just stuff that I want to film videos on I want to start a series on just um, getting back in shape and in the life of mom maybe once we establish more of a routine i'd like to do a daytime and a nighttime routine as a new mom right now it's kind of still all over the place yeah i thank you all for sticking around and i have some really exciting content coming up so just stay tuned and i will talk to you guys very soon have a good day bye